Welcome back everyone, my name's Drew and you're watching Beer for Breakfast Facts for Snacks. <clears throat> Ooh, something on there. Alright, so, I keep saying, you know, throughout the week, I just got home, it's like 7.30, throughout the week, I'm going to have two beers. Well, what a perfect day to pick this big guy. This is one beer. Never said how big it has to be. 950 mil can. Steeler. It is massive. Okay, so this is Labatt now, but back then it was Lakeport, and Lakeport was a craft brewery back then. Okay, so I have a little story about Lakeport. Lakeport uh, Brewing Company was a brewery located in Hamilton, Ontario, Canada. Uh, uh, although it started as a producer of premium beers, <clears throat> it later switched to cheap discount brands using the strategy of selling its beer for a buck a bottle. By 2006, it had become the largest discount brewer in Canada. In 2007, Lakeport was taken over by InBev, which is Labatt. Three years later, InBev closed the Hamilton Brewery plant and shifted production of Lakeport beers uh, to the Labatt plant in London. Um, 24, 24 takeover, 2000 InBev. Okay, so uh, Labatt bought, because Lakeport was selling so many beers back then. Uh, they bought the company for $201.4 million, which is outrageous in 2007. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to go to Untapped. We're going to get into this because that's a lot of beer. I should have done this in the Stein. That would have been just one beer. $4.80 for this big boy. Uh, I might get another one and do that in the Stein. Uh, chug and see if I could do it better. We'll see. Um, on untapped, um, see, excuse me. See, this is where the problem is. Steeler, Labatt Brewing Company. <coughs> excuse me, sorry about that. 371 ratings, 2.62%, or 2.62 2 out of 5. So they really are just. They don't like this. No one likes this. I like it because this is one beer. All right, let's get into it, guys. Um, I'm looking forward to this, actually. All right. So, it's got that head I don't like. Um, I bet you they brew it with corn. I, I haven't really gotten right down to it. Yeah, corn, it's a lager. It's 5%. This is like your average lager. A lot of bubbles. Clearer than anything. Like you can, you can see the middle finger I just gave you guys through there. Right, can you? Yeah, I thought so. Sorry. I love you guys. I shouldn't be doing that. Okay. Corn, that's it. That's it. It's just corn. Um, it's going to be crisp. It's going to be refreshing. This is your just adjunct, adjunct lager that is mass produced right now. And it only comes in these big cans. Only comes in these big cans. $4.80. Alright, so it's crisp. It tastes a little bit like corn. There's actually not much to it. <clears throat> There's no aftertaste to this. Like this is where I don't understand why it's 2.62. Because this is a, a very drinkable lager. All right, so little tiny bit of aftertaste. Nothing like a Canadian or anything. That's, it's just your average lager. I'm going to give it... 6.8 out of 10. Would I buy this again? Yeah, for $4.80 if I only want one beer for the night. Uh, just to uh, sit back and watch a movie. This would be the one to go for because this is actually two beers, two tall cans, and one big can. <clears throat> and 
for four dollars and eighty cents why not right but then you think about uh, if you buy old Milwaukee ice or something a 473 mil can that's two dollars so two of them is four dollars so this is a bit more pricier than that so why would I pay 480 for this I could just have two of those beers so realistically it's sort of a little ripoff I will buy it again but now thinking about it I don't know <sighs> six eight out of ten I can't I can't change my rating now because I'm only give out one and now I'm pissed off that I gave you that stupid rating God why would I rate it so quick 6.8 out of 10 it's lower than that but I can't say it now 5.7 so 6.8 out of 10 that's my rating for this 5.7 anyways have a great day I'm going to be back tomorrow evening with another uh, review like comment and subscribe please this is my second job have a great day guys cheers